Hi there, today we are going to design a resume that is one of the most important job search document. It plays an important part to get hired in any company. You can download it from the link provided in the description and you can use it for yourself. So let's get started. This is A4 size page. We will add a rectangle shape on the top in which we will add our name and picture. Add a circle for our image. Place your image here which you want to add. I have downloaded this image from unsplash.com. Place the circle on the top. Select both of them and make a clipping mask. You can watch the detailed video on the clipping mask from the link that is provided on the top. Type your name here. In the bottom type your profession. I will create a rectangle. Send it back. Now add a rectangle here to add your basic info. Add the rectangle to type the contact with bold font style. Adjust it on the previous rectangle like this. Now add the contact detail. So we will add contact icons which we have created in the previous video. Link is provided on the top. We will match the colors of these icons uh, with our resume that is white and blue. Now add them to your resume. Align them with the help of the align tool. The next step is to add the info according to the icons. Like phone, email address, website address and location. You can edit it with a double click on it. Next we will add scales. You can add the scales according to your profession. I am adding a skill bar to rate the skills. You can add here even a simple percentage. In graphic designing skills, I am adding Photoshop, Illustrator, UI Design and Premiere Pro. The next point is hobbies. I am adding points for hobbies. Add your hobbies one by one. You can add the shadow for this rectangle by going to filter then stylize and then choose the drop shadow. Set the opacity where you like it. Create a duplicate of this rectangle and decrease its size. Add the about point here. Add the text paragraph. Here you will describe about yourself. Copy the rectangle again for the experience section. Add your experience with the year and uh, companies. In the last, add the education. Add a degree and university here. Now our resume is complete. You can turn off the drop shadow from the appearance panel. You can create any style of mockup for your resume. Copy the whole document and paste it into a new document. You can create a mockup for your resume like this.
and add the drop shadow. I hope this video will be useful for you. You can ask any question in the comment section regarding this tutorial. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video. Thank you.